Happy Friday, wellness seekers. My name is Maria Malik of Aroma Living by Design, and this is a quickie of Living Elevated. Um, I'd like to say that I'm going to do a video every Monday or every Tuesday religiously, but um, I'm probably not. I'm going to do it sporadically, and then you'll know that you're really dipping into a day in my life because I don't plan these things. I just get started with a project and I go, hey, this would be really cool if I filmed it. So this is what I'm doing. And I wish I had thought of this earlier uh, to film how big this piece of cabbage was, but look at the size of these leaves. Are these incredible? So I'm gonna be making two meals with this. And I started making it and I said, let me show my people. So I'm gonna be doing two things. I'm making a cabbage soup and I already cut it and cooked it down. You could tell this isn't a professional video because I'm not viewing, um, you know, filming directly over it. So here's the cabbage with onions and chicken broth. And you might think, oh wow, you spent all day making chicken broth? No, I don't. This is my little shortcut. I like shortcuts. It is organic. I'm praying, you know, that what they say is in here is in here. Okay, I put four of those in here. Then I put a splash of apple cider vinegar, and I mean a splash. And then I even put some liquid aminos, brag a liquid aminos. It's got aminos in there. Aminos are good for your muscles, they're good for you. I don't really know what they're good for, I just know they are. So that's part of my life hack. You don't have to know what each ingredient does to your body. I mean, do you want to know what each ingredient of a chemical does to your body? Do you even ask those questions? So why do you care? If someone uh, who of some reputation that you trust um, says, hey, do this, it's good for you, it's gonna make you feel better, don't you just do it? So I'm hoping I could be that person for you because um, I've spent many, many years trial and error finding the things that work and don't work. Is my way necessarily going to work for you all the time? Probably not. You're probably not as anal as I am. <clears throat> so there's my soup. There's the base. And then from uh, Thanksgiving, we have some ham, ham steaks. And I'm like real easy breezy about this. I just take a scissor and I cut it into the crock pot. Boom, boom shakalaka. I like saying that. Um, I was thinking of something fun that we could do. Do you see my fun earrings? I love fun earrings. Message me, I'll give you my address. Send me a pair of fun earrings and I will wear them and give you a shout out and then I'm gonna send you something of an essential oil goodness, whether it's a book, an oil sample, or maybe some product sample, send me your fun earrings. Message me. Let's see what comes up. How fun is that? It's not just a giveaway. You got to get something. You got to give something to get something. This time, at least. So now, this is all going to cook. I put in some Yukon potatoes. Um, this is how you make a little bit into a lot. And in my house, I like to make a big pot of something. So when the kids come home, they bring their friends. Typically, in a busy season of kids, I've got seven to ten people here every day. Am I feeding that many people all the time? Yeah, I am, with some really amazing goodness. Um, and then I'm just going to show you what oils I'm going to put in this concoction is um, rosemary and lemongrass. Why am I doing that? I don't know. That's what my intuition is telling me to do. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm putting that literally one drop. And if you want to know, okay, two came out. I lied, two. Um, if you want to know what each one is about, you could go online, you could do a research. Um, I really don't know, again, what each and every oil does specifically for the body. 
I just know it's good. Again, you don't have to know everything. Did you know that cilantro chelates heavy metals out of your body? No, you just like cilantro, so you eat it. And such is life and such is nature. Um, okay, so because this video is getting longer than I expected, now with these huge leaves, what I'm going to do is make stuffed cabbage. So I'm going to take the leaves, I'm going to put them in a big pot of water, cook them down so they're pliable. And then I'm going to fill them with chopped meat and rice and maybe some roasted peppers or another assorted goodness that I have in the refrigerator. I don't know why I'm stuttering. Um, and that's basically it. So you could take one head of cabbage and you can make a couple of different meals. You can make a really huge meal or you can make one that's going to take a little more labor. If you're not into it, call me. I'll make them for you and ship them. How about that? So with that said, send me fun earrings. I'll give you a shout out and then I will send you a gift as a thank you for your generous participation. My name is Maria Malik, and I'm just a mom. Peace out.